All right, two dozen people had to be rescued from a popular fishing charter boat down the shore. Well, you know, this all unfolded Monday in the waters off Townsend Inlet Bridge between Sea Isle City and Avalon. And Eyewitness News reporter Ryan Hughes has the latest on what happened. 24 hours after the popular starfish charter boat nearly sunk in Sea Isle City, the boat was still beached and stuck in the marsh. My dad has put his heart and soul into this thing, um, and it's definitely gut wrenching and it's definitely heartbreaking for him. The Coast Guard in Sito could be seen in the water near the CIO Yacht Club as workers inspected the damage. We're told the starfish suffered a gash to the hull, and several compartments started to flood on its way back from a four hour fishing trip Monday. We were able to take two boats out from over here and got the passengers off safely. Brittany DeClemente says she hopped in one boat, and her dad, Captain Bob, who owns starfish boats, hopped in another. He was able to help rescue the 22 people on board, bringing them to nearby docks. The mayor of CIL says the current was strong Monday, and the boat likely hit the Townsend Inlet Bridge when it started taking. On water. That is when the starfish then put out a distress call. Jesse Price works at the yacht club and saw the starfish tipping over. He also jumped into action. Me and uh, one of my guys hopped in our power boats just to make sure everyone was good, but by the time we got there, you know, everyone was already evacuated. Luckily, no one was injured, but the starfish has been a staple in Sea Isle, hosting fishing trips for decades. Now its slip is empty and the boat out of commission during its busiest time of the year. It's a tragedy for the, uh, for the company that owns the uh, boat, obviously, and uh, it's tragedy for folks that want to go fishing. But Starfish Boats vows it will be back as the Coast Guard continues to investigate. Whether it is the Starfish and we fix it or it's another boat, we do hope to be back and we'll put a boat right back on that same slip again. In CIO City, Ryan Hughes, CBS 3, Eyewitness News. All right, we wish them the best there. Yes, we do. Yeah, all right, let's check.